It's almost as if she doesn't know anything about computers. What? <laughs> I want to talk to you guys about the 901 and 902 exam, or just the CompTIA exam period. Um, I'm gonna let you guys know my, you know, my thoughts on it, my experience, um, and give you guys some tips. Um, give you some, give you guys some tips as well as to how you can pass it in four months um, or less, um, depending on your experience and how determined you are. Um, so if you are interested, then stay tuned. Quick. Hopefully it's a quick video um, about the A plus uh, certification or the A plus exam. Um, I just passed my 902 and um, I also passed my 901 obviously. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to give a couple tips um, that could be useful to anyone who's thinking about taking it. Um, or you know maybe you've like taken it and like you failed it or whatever first of all if you've taken it and you failed it like don't let that discourage you or throw you off keep going keep trying um, use the um, printout paper they give you and it tells you the areas that you you know need to study more in use those because that's what helped me my first time I took the 901 I failed it um, and I used the printout that they gave me that showed me all the areas that I needed to you know study more in and I use that and it worked for me so basically what I use for um, this particular test is I end up using um, a lot of the practice questions um, I use I'm gonna you use alert I'm gonna put in the description um, the websites that I I used um, but I use Professor Messer. If you go to his website, just type in professormesser.com. He has a spew of things that you can um, use on, you know, for the 901 and the 902. Lots of practice questions. He also has um, a, a bunch of practice questions that you can purchase. I think it's like 600 or 700 questions, both uh, for the 901 and the 902. I only purchased the question bundle for the 902. Um, but I'm sure the 901 would have been just as good. So, professormaster.com, he has a whole bunch of goodies on there for you. Videos as well as practice questions. Um, Exam Compass is another good website. And um, Crucial Exam is another good website. Both of those, all three of those websites are like filled with practice questions. Um, you know, trying to understand what that particular term meant. Um, that helped me tremendously. Um, also, you know, the ones that I think I don't, I think it's a crucial exam that does it. That, um, or correct me if I'm wrong, but crucial exam, I think the questions that you get wrong, they not only give you the right answer, but they also give you, um, you know, a full description as to why that's the right answer. Or the, I'm sorry, why it's the you know wrong answer and tells you if, you know what the right answer is. So I use that to my advantage. Like whenever I would take a test, I would go and all the ones I got wrong, I would go look it up, Google it, and try to um, understand you know why I got it wrong. Um, also, yeah, I mean I think that's really that's that's literally what I use. I just I did practice test you guys. And I got my A plus. Um, other tip also would be it helped me. I don't know about other people, but watching Professor Messer's 901 and 902 um, videos, like his lessons on YouTube. If you just type in Professor Messer CompTIA A plus 901, or you know you type in 902, he has like there's playlists of just all Professor Messer 901 and 902. Um, um, also, I would say. Um, Another thing that could help you to pass um, the, you know, A plus exam would be use the apps you guys on your phone. I have an Apple, um, Apple. <laughs> I have an iPhone, you guys. Um, so you know the market, the market, the apps are limited for me in a sense of free apps. Um, but I took advantage as of many free apps that I could find, you know, in the app store. And um, I'll definitely see if I can um, screenshot the apps that I use and maybe add them to the end of this video or just, you know, I'll put the names in the description. But use the apps. If you have, whether you have Android or you have um, an iPhone, either way it goes, you may have more of a selection if you have an Android. Use the apps, you guys. Like I used, I took the apps are basically taking, you know, your practice test. You have it with you on the go. 
that's what helped me like whenever I would have downtime I'm taking the practice test like you know before I go to bed like I was just so like just resilient when it came to studying for this and making sure that I understood it because when you keep taking these practice tests you're getting yourself familiar with taking a test number one and two familiar with how the questions can be worded um, I'm also gonna leave the name or the link of the YouTube video that I use for both the 901 and the 902 um, I think if you go you know to YouTube and you type in um, 901 exam questions or something it's this actual youtube video that it's like five hours long but i just sped it up but it's like five hours long and it's just pure questions and it gives you the answers you guys i kid you not i've had on both the 901 and the 902 this particular um youtube page i've had questions on both from these videos that I mean, you know, that were on these videos also on my actual test. I've had at least one or two questions on both. So I'm going to leave a link to that YouTube video as well because that helps tremendously. Those questions are very similar to the exam questions. So, okay, so my experience with taking um, the 902 exam, and this ties into the 901 too, but my experience taking the 902 exam, you guys, I kind of ran out of time. <laughs> like, I, I was for sure that I bombed it um because i skipped i used the flagging you know tool and i flagged a lot of questions and i started halfway through the test and started getting afraid because i'm looking at the time and then i'm looking at how many questions i had and i was like okay yeah this is not good and um but i just kept going i kept going i kept going i honestly saved all of my performance based questions until the very end which almost beat me in my butt that's why i said you know it just depends on the question you get because by spending too much time on one question you know you forfeit you know yourself actually getting to questions that you know and that could actually help you to pass the test um so that, that's my tip for taking it don't spend too much time on one question use flagging to your advantage um, also i would say um performance-based questions they normally give those to you i want to say like i don't know the beginning i think yeah so skip those if you're not especially if you're unsure of it i always just save my performance based questions to the very end you know what i mean that could work against you though like if you're totally unsure but also your your performance based question try to save those um to the end um what else what else what else you know i've seen some people you know saying not to cram like the day of or the night before i crammed i took practice tests until i walked into that testing center you guys like you know <laughs> I, I it didn't matter to me so just you're however you learn then that's how you learn another tip i would say about the test um arrive early um you know because they have to check you in and um, you know take your ID and all that stuff so give yourself enough time for that day to take your test it's funny because both of the times I took my test well the first time I took my 901 the first time that I failed and then the time that I took my 902 this last time I was like damn near like late to both of my exams and it can really mess with you you know you want to come into your test you know confident you're not rushing because you're thinking about am I gonna make it have enough time you know to take a test be there early i like to be places early rather than sitting there struggling and stress out thinking am i gonna like have enough time for you know what i have to do um like and subscribe um leave tips for other people and you know let other people know your experience what was your experience like taking you know either one the 901 or the 902 exam and yeah um see you guys soon